Valentine's Day is 24 hours. Let me give you an example, two examples. My, uh, I sent flowers to my wife several years, well, well, probably more than a decade back on Valentine's Day. And she had a name similar to another young lady at this large company. And the other young lady got her flowers. So, of course, after the error has been noted, you don't go to repossess the other lady's flowers. You get them sent again. But the excitement just doesn't come on the February 15th flowers. Uh, second time, I knew uh, a great flower vendor. And one season, despite them having tremendous orders, they got a bad batch of flowers from the wholesaler. And so everybody's flowers were not what they should be. The wholesaler replaced them and had them ready for February 15th. They also found out that February 15th flowers just weren't as exciting. A lot of those people asked for their money back. Not, I'm not here to talk about the ills of the flower industry, but guess what? It's 24 hours. Don't go to the bridge. Don't lose your mind. They took some great Valentine's pictures. Someone's writing a nice thing. And who knows, they could be fighting again on tomorrow. Just a lot of times, just remember, it's a single 24-hour slot. You may not be in the optimum position in your mind to enjoy that day, but it's a man-made holiday. I would like to think that those who are really in love are in love every day not just on February 14th. Just had to tell some that Valentine's Day is 24 hours. Don't go to the bridge over what happens in a 24 hour period. Don't go crazy. Don't say that that's everybody else got somebody but me for 24 hours. Look, it's 24 hours. If you got somebody fantastic, love them. Uh, great, show many signs of love. But you should love them every day also. But don't take yourself to the limit and make your hair fall out and hit your head against the wall about a 24-hour period. Be blessed.